Hey everyone, welcome to Photoshop Pro Help and today I'm going to be teaching you this cool effect which is called the Supernova. Now someone on YouTube asked me to make this effect from a written tutorial um, so I'm putting it into a video for them. And first things first, to create this effect we want to go to File and New and then we want to change the width and height now we can have any size uh, that we want as long as they're the same so my one's going to be 1684 pixels by 1684 pixels in height now once you've done that click OK and we're going to change the foreground and background color to black and white so make sure you do that from here we're going to go to filter we're going to go to render and clouds and from here again we're going to go to filter we're going to go to sketch and graphic pen and we're going to keep all the default settings and then click ok from here we're going to go to filter blur and we're going to go to radial blur and the amount is going to be 100 the blur method is going to be zoom and the quality is going to be set to best click ok and we're just waiting for the product progress bar to load now once you've done all of this now this can take a little while depending on what you've got going on this progress so hopefully it'll be done soon now that's done we can go back up to filter and click radial blur which should be at the top of the uh, page and then click and wait for the progress bar as I said, it can take a little while, depending on how much stuff you've got going on in the background. I've got a few things going on. So here we go. Now from here, we're going to duplicate that layer. So Control and J. Now if you don't want to do it that way of duplicating, you can just drag and drop that image, that layer, to the new blank layer icon at the bottom, which is next to the bin, and it'll just duplicate it for you. Now once you've done that, we're going to select the top layer, we're going to go to Filter, Distort and Twirl and we're going to put 250 for the angle, click OK and then we're going to go to the bottom layer, we're going to go to Filter, Distort and Twirl again but this time we're going to put it to minus 250, so put a minus sign in now and then click OK. Once you've done that, we're going to go to the top layer, we're going to change the blending mode to overlay. And from here, we're going to go down to the bottom and you'll see this little circle that's black and white. Click that, click hue and saturation, and then we're going to get this new layer. Right click that layer, we're going to put a crate clipping mask, and we're going to colorize it. And then you can have any color that you want. So I'm going to go for a bright green, put the saturation up and from here we're going to hit the bottom layer and we're just going to do exactly the same what we just did so hit the black and white circle go to hue and saturation right click that new layer and go to create clipping mask once you've done that click colorize and then we can change to any color that we want so something like that would do that's quite nice and that's pretty much the tutorial done so I hope you enjoyed the tutorial guys please comment rate and subscribe and please go and visit my website check out the advertising program I've got going on where you can click the advertising space and you can put your own banners in it and advertise your YouTube and or your websites for a fee so please go and check that out and I'll see you in my other videos, guys. Bye for now.